Now, as I mentioned, there is a huge divide between critics and audiences. You go on Rotten Tomatoes. Okay, first of all, who the fuck goes to Rotten Tomatoes for reviews anymore? Anywho, you go on Rotten Tomatoes. Okay, the critic review for this special is 45%. According to the last time I saw it, 45%. The audience, 95%. Critics hated it. Audiences love it. Why? I think a critic, the fact that sometimes they have to appeal to the opinions of the masses for their opinions to not only be taken seriously, but also be heard in the first place. Therefore, their opinions are not grounded in reality. Their opinions are not, their opinions are merely grounded in the reality they have constructed for themselves, okay, in order to appeal to these goddamn masses. Therefore, their opinion doesn't fucking matter. <laughs> I don't know, man. You come at me with as many fucking degrees as you freaking want. Like, if you, if I see a movie, I genuinely enjoy it. And then you sit down and give me the scientific reasons that you didn't enjoy it. I'm still going to disagree with you. I'm not going to elaborate it. Like, is it such a crime to just like something? I think Dave embodies, like, the zeitgeist of comedy that's been missing in the last few years. Okay, because apparent comedy used to be an open house. It used to be a place where the court jester, the court jester can not only be a court jester, but also be a philosopher, present you with ideas and ways of thinking that you may never thought about it, present an angle to a certain situation that maybe you never thought about, all right? You might agree with it, you might disagree with it, but I think the most masterful comedians would just let you, you know, think about it a little bit.